Hey there. Today I'm going to show you how to create a transparent header that merges with your navigation using the Generate Press theme. All right, so this is exactly what we're going to look to achieve. As you can see, um, the page hero section, the design is merged with the header so that the navigation is transparent um, and the image goes underneath it. So this is achieved using the Generate Press elements. Um, and so currently, as you can see, I have a element here and I titled it page header merge. This is the feature that allows you to create that transparent navigation um, just by changing this first setting under site header, merge with content, and you're going to say merge. Um, so if we were to go ahead and disable this real quick, make it a draft and refresh our website. You'll see now our navigation, um, well, first isn't readable because it's white text on white background, um, but the image is pushed down now below it and it's using a white background header. So I'll show you how to do that from scratch. We're going to say add new element and choose header, hit create. And of course, um, you could say page merge or name it whatever you like. Um, and the very first setting, site header, merge with content, we're going to say merge. Um, now you can offset that header height depending on how your design is laid out. Um, it's something I've never personally used and it's, it's not anything that pertains to my design. Um, now display rules, we're going to go ahead and say entire site. However, if you wanted to do um, an altering layout, say on the home page, you only wanted to merge. However, on your blog posts, uh, you want a traditional layout with a um, header that isn't transparent um, and sits below the navigation. Um, you can actually exclude whatever pages you want this merge to not live on. So I'm going to go ahead and choose the entire site and hit publish. Come back, refresh, and there it goes. It's back to merging with the header. Um, now, be sure to pay attention to the navigation colors. Um, if we jump into the customizer and we go to colors and header, or excuse me, primary navigation, that's the one we want to look at. The navigation background right here, if these actually have colors to them, um, it could affect, oh, I got it, zero transparency it could affect the way it looks, right? So if I had a red background here, you could still have red. So you always wanna make sure to slide that transparent slider all the way down and delete any color uh, within your primary navigation background. As you can see, you doing a transparent header in Generate Press is pretty quick and easy. I'll see you next time.